Good morning. I'm Thomas Vago, General Manager of the Hilton Fort Lauderdale Beach Resort, and it is my pleasure to welcome the National Senior Games at our beautiful resort. We are honored to be the host hotel for the National Senior Games, and I look forward to providing you an unrivaled experience. Here at our resort, you will enjoy luxury accommodations in one of our residential style suites, free dining establishments, and access to amenities like Spa Q, rooftop pool, and beach service on our famed Fort Lauderdale Beach. As a community, our fellow hospitality industry leaders can't wait to welcome you, and we're all looking forward to welcoming the National Senior Game athletes and fans very soon. We're also here today with Visit Lauderdale, uh, which is the tourism and marketing organization for Broward County. And allow me to introduce Stacy Ritter, who is the president and CEO of Visit Fort Lauderdale. Stacy. On behalf of Visit Lauderdale, it is a privilege and honor to serve as the host destination for the 2022 National Senior Games, the largest multi-sport championship event in the world for adults 50 and over. We look forward to welcoming National Senior Game organizers, esteemed athletes, their families, and sports fans to our cosmopolitan destination for these spectacular games. Greater Fort Lauderdale is a sports enthusiast's dream and is the ideal year-round location for all sporting events. We have no doubt a great time will be had by all. The entire county will benefit greatly from the games, which will be taking place in Greater Fort Lauderdale for the first time. The estimated total impact for Greater Fort Lauderdale is $23.5 million. Greater Fort Lauderdale is a great place to maintain an active and healthy lifestyle. We celebrate sporting at any age. With eight beaches, world-class sports venues, a variety of outdoor recreation activities and water sports, nature parks, and our 24 miles of golden beaches, there is so much to explore and enjoy here. Now, we'd like to sh share a sneak peek at what you can expect here at what makes our beach destination different. Hit it! That's what I'm talking about! Wait! Okay now, from the beginning. We invite you to explore our 31 diverse cities, each offering cultural rich attractions and culinary experiences. More than 40,000 restaurants and over 50 breweries are things of which, from which you can choose. Indulge in an oceanfront stay such as the lovely Hilton Fort Lauderdale Beach Resort where we are today. To the 13,000 athletes competing in these games, we celebrate you and can't wait for you to join us in 2022. We look forward to welcoming everyone under the sun here in our vibrant Greater Fort Lauderdale. Humana is the presenting sponsor for the National Senior Games and the Florida Senior Games. We're delighted to have Humana South Florida Medicare President Betty on hand to share a few words. Good afternoon, everyone, and thank you, Stacy. I'm thrilled to be here on behalf of Humana and to take part in this year-out event for the 2022 National Senior Games, which will mark the 15th year that Humana's commitment to the Senior Games athletes. It's not often that we find a sponsorship like the Senior Games, which aligns so perfectly with Humana and our members and our brand. Um, in addition to supporting the National Senior Games, Humana also has a long legacy of supporting the state and local games across the country. This year, we're happy to be here at the end of the year in December for the Senior Games for Florida, and then again, we'll be back here for the Senior Games, the National Senior Games in 2022. Our Humana team in South Florida is really excited that both of these will take place here in Fort Lauderdale. 
Um, we happen, uh, we also uh, will be presenting, be the presenting sponsor of both of these amazing events, and we are excited to have them here. I can promise you our team is committed to doing all we can to support the incredible athletes who serve as such an inspiration to us all. If you've watched these athletes compete, you know that you can't help but be inspired by their dedication to their sports, to their health, and to all of the friends that they make along the way. Thank you. Again, I would like to introduce Mr. Mark Riker. He's the National Senior Games Association CEO. Thank you, Betty. Also, thank you. What a beautiful day to be here at the Fort Lauderdale Hilton Beach Resort to announce the year out celebration for the 2022 National Senior Games. They'll be right here in Broward County next year in Greater Fort Lauderdale. What an exciting time ahead of you. We can't wait for you to be here. We know there's some other news we've been waiting for from our athletes. We want to know the competition schedule and the housing information. Our team is here this week doing the final details on all that stuff. So soon that information will be out, so hold out. But we've got some other exciting news to share with you today. We also want to thank the Florida Senior Games for excellent work they do in encouraging statewide games across the entire state and then culminating in their annual games. This year, they're going to have their annual games right here in Broward County in December. And we encourage you to take a chance to look at that and consider coming down, checking the area out, getting familiar with it, and seeing some of the venues that we'll be using next year at the National Games. We're really excited here now to have one of the special athletes from the Florida Senior Games, Brian Hankerson. Brian started track and field at 43. However, by leaps and bounds, he's taken over as an accomplished athlete. He holds the number one position in long jump in the 50 to 54 category, the 55 to 59, and the 60 to 64 category. Brian, now you're gonna be competing on your home turf. What do you feel about that? Well, I'm so excited to be uh, competing here in Greater Fort Lauderdale. Uh, I really enjoy the camaraderie amongst the various athletes. The competition is gonna be intense. That's why I'm making sure I'm training, training diligently so that I might perform well against that intense competition. Good, thanks Brian. Well, yourself obviously, what do you think about your fellow athletes here from Florida? Are they gonna be motivated to also have the games here in the Sunshine State? Well, you said at Sunshine State, what better place to have these games than Greater Fort Lauderdale? I mean, we have great weather, look at the views. We have great food, the venues are gonna be incredible, and we have great people. Can't wait to see you. Well, Brian's a, a little shy in a sense, but Brian was the 2018 Florida Senior Games Athlete of the Year. Quite, quite the accomplishment, Brian. So again, we appreciate you being here today. Some of the other news we want to share with you. One is, again, that the games in 22 will have three new sports. One will be cornhole, one will be soccer, and one will be beach volleyball. How could we not have beach volleyball on the great beaches here in Fort Lauderdale. So again, look forward to that. Plus, these are open events, meaning that you do not have to qualify to participate. So anybody will be able to get in the games, locally and nationally. So get suited up, start training, and be ready for next year. One of the other things that's real exciting news here is the billion dollar renovation that is going on here in the convention center and will be ready for us next spring. We'll be one of the first people to use that venue, and it's gonna be a hub of activities and also a host of many sports that will be contested there. But one of the things we really want to talk about, we've been teasing you on Facebook about some of these big news that's coming for 2022. One of them is new exposure to the games, and that is through our partner, Umana, who has been with us as a presenting sponsor since 2007, 15 years. We are so appreciative of that. They have partnered with USA Today to create a platform for senior games and it's called the USA Today Senior Games Training Center. And that will provide photos, tips, videos, and articles to encourage you to stay active and train to compete in the games. It will evolve over time. There'll be fun tips and fun trivia and sweepstakes going there. So stay tuned as that's coming right around the corner. One of the other big exciting news we really want to share today is the NSGA Cup 
presented by Kohler Walk-In Bath. Over the last several games, we've always recorded the total number of medals the states have won. The large states who typically have larger population, tend to have more athletes compete, typically have the most medals. So we wanted to level the playing field and simply create an award that was gonna be based on medals won by the number of athletes in a state. So that's why this award has been presented. Brian, what do you think of this award? Love it, this is great. You know, this is gonna bring the competition amongst the states to a whole new level. I can't wait. Yes, we're very excited about that, and we actually have an opportunity here. We're going to have a video message from our supporter, Kohler Walk and Bath. Again, thank you to Kohler Walk and Bath to help us in presenting the NSJ Cup as a new way to motivate athletes and encourage you again for that state competition, state pride, as the games will be here in Broward County and Greater Fort Lauderdale next year, May 10th to the 23rd. So, Brian, that award, we'll kind of put it in its resting spot for now. Uh, I don't think so, Mark. Uh, I have it now. I think uh, we'll just keep it in Florida. And if you want to take this away from Florida, well, good luck, but it won't be easy. <laughs> well, oh my goodness, folks. Well, Brian has put the gauntlet down. He is challenging each and every one of you to get ready, start training. You've got a year out there to be ready for the games. Be here in beautiful, sunny Florida, South Florida, Broward County, greater Fort Lauderdale. We know it's been a rough last year for everybody, but things are changing and looking up. It's exciting as this summer our state games are running again. So be sure to check in on your state games to see what events they're running and stay motivated for next year. We know that it's also a great opportunity that we try and provide to keep people setting goals, competing, and having the camaraderie of coming to the senior games. Next year, it is truly gonna be the ultimate reunion of the ages. You do not want to miss it, nor do you want to miss the beach. As we say for the senior games, what we do, we're about fitness, fun, and fellowship. However, next year, it's about fitness, fun, in the sun, and fellowship. Thank you for tuning in today and hearing about the news of our new sports, our new NSGA Cup presented by Kohler Walk and Bath. The new USA Today Senior Games Training Center. Lots of great, exciting things. Again, enjoy the rest of your day. Thank you all. <laughs>